Hello, YouTube. Now, um, right on freedom. Hell yeah. I'll be the first to admit, I got a lot of people that don't like me on YouTube or don't like me in general because I'm kind of an ass sometimes. Sometimes you're all the time jerk off. I'll be the first to admit that I'm not perfect. Obviously. Um. And people saying you're never going to be famous. Really. Then why the fuck do you watch my videos? There are excuses to laugh at the train wreck in front of us. All aboard. Choo choo. Here it goes while you're watching me on YouTube. You're still watching me. I mean, if you got pissed off at me for whatever reason, be it that I'm supposedly full of myself. Which at times I admit I can be full of myself sometimes. Um. I kind of just comb my hair out for this video. I want to take a shower after the video here and then. Bring my bike to work. But the thing that gets me is I'm so full of myself and they hate me this so much. Why the fuck are you watching me? You can say, oh, because you're a train wreck, Mr. Saunders, and you're just funny as fuck to watch you because you're miserable and I'm not. Hmm, I'm miserable. You watch someone more miserable than you on YouTube because it makes you feel better about yourself. <laughs> wow, I don't know, I was a dick. Uh, Uh, I'm not sure what Stephanie's going to say. There's a lot of people have been saying if she has half a brain, she'll dump your sorry ass and leave you. And then what? You all say, oh, I told you so, I told you so. Really? You don't say. And what is doing stuff I can really accomplish? Telling me, I told you so, Saunders, you're just a loser. You're telling me shit I've heard my entire life, man. Nothing new to me. I'm not sure what somebody's gonna say to me if she does call or text back or whatever. But, um. I know it seems fucked up, but my heart's in the right place. And the timing of it was kind of off, you know. Really, if I was such a loser, why the fuck are you still watching me? Seriously, you can say, because you're a train wreck. Yeah. So it's a guy watching the train wreck on YouTube. So it's supposed to train wreck.
you know, those trolls I get on YouTube and Facebook, it's getting really difficult to tell who's a friend and who's just there to fuck with me. And the thing that gets me is you're that obsessed with fucking with me. You, you got nothing better to do with your life. You don't have a job or a girlfriend or whatever. You know, it seems like you're more hell-bent on fucking with me because you got nothing better to do with your life. And if that isn't the case, then by all means, whatever. Now, people are saying I'm going to be famous for my music. Okay. Well, Gangnam Style, whatever it's called, wasn't famous until recently. It was probably just like me on YouTube, kind of doing whatever, and someone big noticed it and it caught on. Okay. And now it's famous. Now, for me, it's just a matter of waiting patiently and just keep trying. And people say you should just give up because you're never going to be famous. You don't realize you're motivating me even more to try harder. Because I can't chill on MTV for some music video I did. I'm really like, this is all my haters. Fuck you, I'm on MTV, motherfucker. Is here. <laughs> like I said, I can admit I'm not perfect, obviously, but I think some people get the wrong impression of me. This condescending full of himself asshole he's just above everybody yeah, yeah, yeah. let's do one thing clear I speak my mind I'm not afraid to say what I gotta say and some people are just comfortable living in their delusional lies of a life that sounds repetitive doesn't it well it's the truth so your best friend gets a hat Alright, and he's all into it and shit, and he has to be honest with his opinion. Hey man, how do I look in this hat? Now, you could be a dick and say, you look like shit, dude. So you look ridiculous. You don't have to be as bluntly honest, but just, you can tone it down. You can just say what you gotta say without being a total dick about it. But let's say you don't say that. You tell your friend, oh, you look amazing in that hat, dude. You, you should, like, totally work at school or whatever. I was like, yeah, that's what I was gonna do. Sweet. Sniper Frank goes to school the next day, and everyone's laughing at him. Oh my god, you look like a retard wearing that hat. Now he's going to go to you and go, You told me you looked awesome. Dude, seriously, you lied to me. Now, lying is the ultimate form of disrespect, in my opinion. Okay? That's why I confess to Stephanie, because I got all the respect for her. Like I said, Sometimes my intentions are misread in the wrong direction. And you act like I'm the first guy she has girlfriend or whatever. My fellow Americans. <laughs> Seriously. No, it's easy to pick on the autistic kid because, let's face it, I'm an easy target. Um, I won't deny that. I'm socially awkward. But do you ever think that I make myself an easy target on purpose sometimes just because I'm not going to respond? And you're so stupid enough to troll me? Hmm. Just saying. Now, when, when my music does take off, it's going to be an awesome day indeed. And even if it doesn't take off, man, oh well, I'm doing something I love. That's making music, because I'm a musician. And granted, some people don't like my music because it's obviously the concept of my music is too deep for some to comprehend. Oh well. I'm not going to to sleep over it, obviously. You just some lose your golf working a dead end job at Wendy's. You're going nowhere with your life. Just 
to have a job and a place of my own. It's something. It's better than nothing. I mean, yeah, I could sit here and bitch about the things that aren't perfect in my life, which I kind of do sometimes. Sometimes I need to realize that, yeah, sometimes my, my life can suck, but I have it pretty good. I got my own place. I'm moving up in the world. I'm in a functioning adult in society. Uh, I can't tell you how many times my parents have said, I need to be in a home for people with Asperger's, or you need to give this, this, or that, and blah, 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 whatever. And I said, no. Okay, I told them, no. I'm, I want to be in a, a group home for people with Asperger's. And uh, it's not a bad thing, Josh. I'm like, I know it's not a bad thing, but goddamn it, I want to be independent and make my own life happen. Because I'm determined to prove to myself that I can be a functioning adult in society, despite the fact that I dress like this. And despite the fact that I have autism. It's overcoming obstacles and quite frankly having Asperger's is a major obstacle in my life I deal with it on a day to day basis now if you have Asperger's that's fine you understand what I'm talking about but if you don't have it then you don't understand what it's like so um, I'm not sure what Stephen's going to say to that message I left here but I much rather her find out from me than from someone else, because that's going to make it ten times worse. This is like my sixth or seventh bowl of pipe tobacco. Honestly, if you didn't think that much of me, y'all are able to see my videos. <laughs> Some of the comments are like, You have a dick tattoo on your arm, you work on a dirty that job at one day's rah, 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 rah. What, you mean this? Symbol of my religion. Um, it's not a dick, obviously, but if you got a dick on the line, hey man, that's cool if you're gay, man. I'm not gonna judge you for it, you know what I'm saying? Shit. But if I'm such a condescending asshole, why the fuck are you still watching my channel? My videos? Because you think that justifies your pathetic life and watching my life more pathetic than yours, supposedly. Now I'm a train wreck. And I admit I have my depression in spurts more so than others because of my Asperger's. It's a depression disorder, high functioning autism. But if anything, my videos can be a guide, if you will. A guide to people who have, or know people in their life who have autism, high functioning autism or Asperger's. It's not a life sentence, it's not a death wish or anything like that. It's just a somewhat minor um, condition I have to deal with. It's minor in what, it's, what causes it, but dealing with it, it's not minor at all, by any means. Yet despite the fact that I have autism, knowing that that I'm socially out of place and I'm awkward and whatever else you all call me, I'm still on YouTube making videos. I know that I suck, I know that I have no life and blah 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 whatever, but I'm still on YouTube making videos. That shows I have more confidence in myself, and that's a good thing. In a way, YouTube's kind of therapeutic for me, I'm able to express myself to anyone who cares to listen. I don't you care, otherwise you wouldn't watch. <laughs> so... I should have switched to pipe tobacco completely. It'd be a lot cheaper than cigarettes, but sometimes manual life sucks. You need a cigarette. Plain and simple. <laughs> but, oh well. Anyway, I'm off to take a shower and get ready for work. So, because so unfortunately, cause fortunately enough, I do have a life. I know it's hard to believe, but I do. Until then, this is um, King Cobra JFS for another video.
Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.